There's a lot to look for in a car, or truck, or any type of vehicle that you love to drive. A great example of this is looking for not just speed and precision, but being able to go and get a vehicle with a good safety rating. The higher a safety rating, the more likely you are to get a car, right? Well, sadly, there are a few vehicles out there in the United States that are known to have an OK safety ratings, but are not safe at all to drive. So allow us to show you some of these vehicles. Be sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Number 10. Ford Mustang GT Coupe 2015 to 2018. When you hear the name Mustang, you think of a fast car that has turned heads for many a decade and thus must be a fun car to drive. And to an extent, yeah, you'd be right. But for 2015 and 2018 brands of the Ford Mustang GT Coupe, you might want to stay away from them. Why are only these years singled out? Because during those years, the structure of the car changed a bit and the safety cage didn't wow a lot of safety critics thus proving that they went down in safety during these years. Here are some numbers on that. 81 deaths per million registrations, 23 deaths per million single vehicle crashes, 12 deaths per million single vehicle rollover, 58 deaths per million multi-vehicle crashes. Number 9. Kia Rio 2015-2018 to Not so fun fact. In a certain list, the Kia Rio was the number one deadliest car in America in 2018 and the number two most deadliest car in 2019 so the fact that it has dropped 7 slots does help, but it's still a very dangerous car to drive overall. Easily one of the biggest reasons for that is its size. It's honestly a really small car, and thus the safety features on it aren't the best. 87 deaths per million registrations, 38 per million were in single vehicle crashes, 0 deaths per million single vehicle rollover, 51 deaths per million multi-vehicle crashes. Number 8. Nissan Versa 2015-2019 You know you have a bad vehicle if the safety rating is labeled as poor. And that's exactly what the Nissan Versa has, which is not a good label if you're trying to attract people to get the car. One of the biggest reasons for the poor safety rating is a problem with the driver's door. There's an overlap that will be exposed during a crash. So yeah, not exactly setting a good standard there, Nissan. And this car, too, was on the most dangerous car list in the past few years. 88 deaths per million registrations. 42 deaths per million were in single vehicle crashes. 14 deaths per million single vehicle rollover. 49 per million multi-vehicle crashes. Number 7. Kia Forte 2015-2018 Arguably one of the more popular cars of the Kia brand, the Kia Forte had some rather darker safety ratings in the 2015-2018 years which is slightly ironic because one company gave it a top safety rating in 2017, which is odd via the numbers you're about to see. But one of the major aspects of the Kia Forte of these years not being so safe is because their headlights were said to perform very poorly, which is not a confidence builder at all. 89 deaths per million registrations, 24 deaths per million single vehicle crashes, 2 deaths per million single vehicle rollover, 63 deaths per million multi-vehicle crashes. Number 6. Hyundai Elantra 2011-2016 As we've been clear about, the year and make of the model in question matters. Because if you were to look at the most recent Hyundai Elantras, you'll notice that they are much better in safety features, even getting some awards. But during the 2011-2016 period, they weren't as good in safety. And thus, they had many accidents and deaths showing that improvements have been made, but that you really need to be careful in regards to which version you get. 89 deaths per million registration, 15 deaths per million in single vehicle crashes, 9 deaths per million single vehicle rollover, 71 deaths per million in multi-vehicle accidents. Number 5. Fiat 500 2012 to 2019 The Fiat is a car brand from Italy that eventually made its way to the US, which should have been a great thing. Plus, the 2012 version and the ones after that had improvements to the front seat of the car in order to make sure the driver was protected from a front collision. Which sounds great, but its safety rating is incredibly poor, and its construction leaves the driver open to harm because the doors are known to fly off and the driver can go with them. 95 deaths per million registrations, 38 deaths per million in single vehicle crashes, 37 deaths per million single vehicle rollover, 60 deaths per million in multi-vehicle accidents. Number 4. Nissan Versa Note 2016-2019 A key distinction here is that this is the Nissan Versa Note, not the Nissan Versa. These are two different models and honestly have two different safety ratings, which is part of the problem because most people associate the safety ratings across the two. But rather, the Note has a much higher danger rate for people. 
95 deaths per million registrations, 38 deaths per million in single vehicle crashes, 37 deaths per million single vehicle rollover, 60 per million in multi-vehicle accidents. Number 3. Chevrolet Sonic 2012 to 2020. You might remember this car being in a Super Bowl commercial where it fell out of a plane. While in truth, the Chevrolet Sonic is not a car you want to drive because it's been deemed very dangerous due to structural issues. 98 deaths per million registrations, 34 deaths per million in single vehicle crashes, 10 deaths per million single vehicle rollover, 64 per million in multi vehicle accidents. Number 2. Hyundai Accent 2012 to 2017. Here is yet another car that is known for poor structure and safety ratings. The years listed are noted for not just having fatalities, but giving all sorts of injuries to people regardless of which part of the car they're in. So even if you're not likely killed by the crash you're in, you're likely going to be severely injured. 116 deaths per million registration, 28 deaths per million in single vehicle crashes, 9 deaths per million single vehicle rollover, 85 per million in multi-vehicle accidents. Number 1. Ford Fiesta 2014 to 2019 A popular used car, the Ford Fiesta is one that needs to be avoided due to all the harm it can cause a person during a crash. Its safety rating is marginal, and there are faults in the system that can lead to severe head injuries in a crash. 141 deaths per million registrations 46 deaths per million in single vehicle crashes 13 deaths per million single vehicle rollover 98 per million in multi-vehicle accidents so there you have it everyone, a look at a large set of vehicles that may be pleasing on the outside, but once you get behind the wheel, things aren't as simple as you might expect. Have you ever driven one of these vehicles? Do you know someone who has had an accident in those vehicles? Are you going to avoid these rides now, now that you know the dangers? Let us know in the comments below, be sure to subscribe, and we'll see you next time on the channel.